guys, it's Eddie the Magic Monk. Recently, I have been coding in PHP again, and um, as always, I always look for better ways of doing things. And I have been trying to print a bit of HTML code with PHP. And what I've been finding is that there are basically three methods. So um, let's just start with the first one. So you go start with a bit of PHP code, just echo. So you use a quotation mark. So within the quotation mark, um, you can type a bit of text. Hello, this is Eddie. And the cool thing with that is you can even just put in the line break and you can put in something else. Um, I have a ball. So let's save that and let's see what it looks like on the internet. So yeah, it all works well. Now, what I'm having trouble with this method is that if I want to include a quotation mark, so if I want to include a quotation mark within the quotation, if I want to say, my dad said, um, I am cool. Now, this is not going to work because as soon as you put in another quotation mark, um, as soon as you put in another quotation mark, it thinks that the string has ended. So if you save and upload this, then it's just going to totally screw up. It's not going to work. So a way around that is to ch change a double quotation to single quotation. If you do that, then it works. Okay, if you do that, then it works. But if I want to now insert single quotation marks within my paragraph, if I want to say something like, I have a friend called Johnny, and I want to use single quotation, then it's not going to work anymore, okay? Because it thinks that you've closed the string off. So if you try and upload this, um, again, it's it screws up. So the way to fix that is to add an escape character, which looks something like this. Um, if you put that in, uh, it should work. No, it's the other way. It's the other slash. Okay, so now if you upload that, now that works. It's got both double and single quotation. Now, the problem with both of these methods is that um, if I have a very large paragraph of text, I'm not going to go in and check whether I have any things I need to escape the character for. So the third way, which is the whole reason why I made this video, sorry for making you guys wait, is called the Herodoc Notation. Now the cool thing about this is that you don't need to worry about including the quotation mark at the beginning um, or at the end. So just get rid of that quotation mark at the beginning, at the end. Have your text that you want to output as a paragraph. And then after the echo statement, put in three angular brackets and then just type in uh, some sort of string. So just go end. And then down the bottom, just have end again and then a semicolon. Okay, so that's called the Herodoc notation. That will output everything in between. So if you save that, and let's look at the result. It outputs everything in between, so you don't need the escape characters anymore. So you can have as many things in there with double quotation mark. My mom said I'm funny. My dad then said that I have a cool brother. 
Okay, so look at how many quotation marks I'm using, different, single, double, everything. And now let's just look, check whether it works. Yes, it's all coming out fine. So Herodoc notation, really awesome. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.